We would call it a no decision. Let's go, Cody, let's go. This is round three. Bryant in the blue, Andrade in the green. There's a left hand by Andrade, and I think that got Bryant's attention. Bryant comes back with a left hand of his own. Let's go to Chuck Giampa for just a moment. Chuck, uh, that was ruled an accidental headbutt. Is that the way you saw it, too? Yes, that's the way I saw it. And uh, because the referee called it an accidental headbutt, if the fight naturally is stopped before four completed rounds, it would be a technical decision or technical draw. If it goes beyond that, then it would go to scorecards. All right, Chuck, thanks very much. As we said, Chuck will be with us all night long. Any kind of uh, controversy, we'll have his scorecard. See how it compares with the official scoring here. This guy's been around a long time, knows what he's talking about. And I think Brian's leg really buckled under him. But he appears to be okay. There's no knockdown involved. That was accidental on both parts. I think the ref should have let him throw some punches while they were down there. Yeah. Maybe a step over toe hold or something. <laughs> right, let him go. Let him go. Step back. Let him back go. For the last Let's couple of rounds, Bryant has been fighting pretty much backing up. He'll stop and throw some shots, but Andrade's pushing him back now. And I don't I don't know that Bryant, unless he lands a big shot the like he just hand, tried to, I don't know if that he can win this fight. Right. Step fighting back. Stop moving backward. Step back. I agree with that. I think he's got to come forward. That was his game plan, but sometimes it's not Let quite as easy to execute your game plan stop. once you get stop. in there. Yeah, if, if Bryant can't get rid of Andrade in the beginning of this fight, he at least has to build up enough of a lead on the cards that if he does fade late, which could very well happen, uh, he can hold on to the win. Another combination right there by Bryant, but again, this could become a numbers game. Good right hand, and that did get Andrade's attention. His legs wobbled with that one. And another one, and now Andrade is in trouble. Another in big trouble. Another right hand. And Velez is going to stop the fight. Bryant's going to win the fight. That is an extreme shocker. And I'll tell you what, I think it was well stopped. And I didn't see Andrade defending himself or throwing any punches. You know, Matt, I disagree a little bit with you because it's Andrade. That's the only reason I say it. Any other fighter, but I think the referee has to know the fighter. By the way, this is a very inexperienced referee from El Paso. Up until tonight, I believe he had only worked four and six round fights. I, I thought it was a little quick. I, I, I understand what you're saying. Those shots were huge. Well, my, the reason I say that, huge and unanswered, but your point is well taken. But you know what? To, to, to your point, when a fighter gets hit with shots that are so clean and so concussive, it sort of forces the referee's hands. Let's take another look at it. And Brian, he was, say, a happy guy, and uh, he finished when he needed to finish. There was that first right hand, and that wobbled the knees. We talk about fighters' knees buckling, his eyes buckled. <laughs> and another one to the top of the head. You can hear the crowd here reacting. This is the same sequence we just saw. Well, Andrade almost just tilted over from the power of those shots. And then he backed up into the ropes. And here's the end. A right hand there. He did have his hands up, I will say that, which makes your point well taken. Well, wow, that, that last shot was, I think, what convinced the referee. I mean, Andrade, you can make a case for the fact that he wasn't able to defend himself. His hands were at his side for the last two punches. I, I think it's, it's arguable. Yeah, I'll give you that. I, I just think because it's Andrade, that, that's my only point. Well, we saw Alfonso Lopez on a previous show, Extreme Card, get beat, the kid from Texas, right. who uh, had fought Kelly Pavlik, and now we have another major, major upset. And Andrade, I, I hate to say it because I root for the kid, but that fourth title shot doesn't look like it's coming. Yeah, no, not now. And uh, meantime, Brian is uh, a thing to think about. Let's go to the center of the room and make an official with Jimmy Lennon. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of two minutes, 19 seconds. In round number three, a referee in charge, Robert Vélez, stops the contest. He is the winner by way of technical knockout, Roland Bryant. So Bryant, Said he was going to try to get him out of there early, and sure enough, he got him out of there early. Cut him early in the fight. That certainly was a factor. But there was no doubt about who the stronger of the two was, without question. I do think you can make an argument for perhaps the fight was stopped a little bit prematurely. I don't think it was, but again, I, I yield to my partner. <laughs>